now guys i want you to just take a look at this man take a look at this this man got created is a disabled is a disabled now let's take a look at this man he's trying to fry egg by himself he's trying to find eggs look at look at what this man is trying to do he's making effort he's making effort to fry eggs by himself now if you go outside you see so many people there with two hands and two legs they are good they are looking good but they are not doing anything all they do is to what to go outside and form sickness and start begging then you see gullible nigerians giving them money please i want to tell you today if you see anybody that has two hands and two legs they have two and they have two legs and they are not doing anything please don't give them one error don't give them shishi tell them to go and look for work to work this man's situation is going to tell you exact it's going to teach you some lessons look at look at the way a man is struggling he's struggling to fry eggs he wants to eat just take a look at this man take a look at him look at what he's doing look at what he's trying to look at look at making effort no no just take a look at look at look oh god why some people are out there they are forming sickness they have two hands and two legs you don't want to do anything you have two hands and two legs all you need to do all you always want to do is to go outside and beg for money beg for money beg people for money because you believe it's business most people have taken it as business i want to give you an example here in Nigeria, there is a place called Ikeja Long. There is this particular guy that always sweep that staircase at Ikeja Long. That bridge is trying to cross it. Ikeja Long. Every time I go there, this guy is always sweeping that particular staircase. He's a disabled. He has no legs. He's crawling, but he's sweeping that staircase, making it clean. People are giving him money because he's working. He is working. He took it as a job and he's doing it. He's not begging you financially, but he's working to make sure he gets this money from you. This is it. These are people. If you see any disabled out there, please kindly try as much as possible to help them. Help them. Give them the little you can. Support them. Make them believe that they are also humans. Please help them. But if you see those that have two hands and two legs and that they don't want to do anything, they don't want to walk, they're always there begging. Please don't give them one error. Don't give them. Time. Look at what this one is doing. Don't give them one error. They are criminals. They are criminals. They are thieves. They don't want to walk. They don't want to. They, want, they don't want to walk. They, they have two hands and two legs. They are criminals. Don't help them. Don't give them one error. They are thieves. Those guys are thieves. They are criminals. Forget about begging, please. I, I, I'm repeating it. Anybody that has two hands and two legs, they are, they are normal. They are working. They are okay. Please don't give them one error. Don't give them a dime. Don't give them a dime. Take a look at this man. They have turned into business. Most of the here in Nigeria, they've converted to business. If you go to any junction, you see them. Please help me, help me. I'm dying. I have kids. Some of them are even forming sicknesses that are not even existing in their bodies. Some of them will go as far as pouring chemical on their legs because they want to beg. Their legs will be big. At the end of the day, they will go and pour another chemical. It will not dissolve. Useless. Useless set of people. Don't give them one error. They're criminals. These guys are criminals. And I keep telling people every day. Some will form ashma, they have ashma. Some will tell you they have done expropriation. Some will tell you they came out from prison. Some will tell you they, are, they have certificates. They will go and forge certificates. They have two hands and two legs. That they need financial financial assistance to, to start up a business. That is a man I met every year. He normally comes to our office. I ask him one day, I say, is this financial assistance not enough? How many years will you continue begging? He never came to my office again. Stop giving them money. You have two hands and two legs. You are look for work. Or go and learn something. Go and find something doing. Take a look at this man's condition. These are the kind of people we need to help. These are the type of people we need to help in our society. If you want to help, help the disabled, those that have no hand, no legs. Look at the way he's struggling to, to, to cook something for, for him to eat. The other time we were interviewing somebody, we were interviewing a man. He has two hands, he has two legs. We ask, oh God, what is actually wrong with you? What's the problem? Can we start up something for you? Do you know what this idiot said to us? You know what this useless man said to us? He said he don't want to start anything, you no, know, that he loves begging. Oh, oh, that he loves begging, that that is the business he wants to do. Begging. <laughs> well, he has two legs and two legs. I told him, I warned him, I said, if any of us see you here in this street again, we will break your head and take you to police station. Ever since then, I've not seen him around. A full-fledged man saying that he doesn't want to work, but what he wants to do is to always beg for money. He has two hands, he has two legs. Nothing is wrong with him. Nothing. Nothing is wrong with him. He's not mad. He's not disabled. He's, he's just normal. And he said to himself that he doesn't want to work. All he wants to do is what? Beg him. And he wants me to give him my money? My other money? No, it's not possible. It's not done. It's not possible. Look at the disabled. Look at what the man is. Look at what he's trying. Look at. Just take a look at it. Take a look at him. Trying to cook something to eat. 
he has fried the four sets which is eggs he has fried eggs now he's frying the chips he's frying the chips trying to prepare something for himself to eat why some people are out there just take a look at the pains this man is going through to cook something for himself to eat he never he never he never even looked down on himself being a disabled, he never looked down on himself. He said, No, I can do it. He encouraged himself and he's doing it. Why some people out there begging? If you're out there begging and you are complete, please stop it. If not, turn down with fire your head.